Hello everyone and welcome back to Generation Makeup. Today we are going to be doing an exciting Ipsy unboxing for the month of October. So if you would like to see that, please keep on watching. Okay, so looking at the bag. Ooh, ooh, it's so pretty. It's like red and it has like a, a, a mask embossing on it. very pretty and it looks like it's uh, a little bit wider than the usual ipsy bag so let's open this up and with every ipsy bag you get five items Ooh, ooh! so who said nights were for sleep ipsy after dark okay so usually around october september fall time starts kicking in and everybody goes into fall mode and you know they bring out the pumpkins and the fall leaves and the pumpkin spice lattes so you'll see a lot of like spooky type things i guess so the first thing that catches my eye is a bu buxom uh lipstick lip polish it's like a kind of pale mauvey pink with some glitters in it looks very nice The glitters look to be gold, champagne-y. So it just looks like a, a regular old lip gloss. Nothing, nothing spectacular, but it is very pretty. It's uh, more sheer than I thought it would be, and it's a pretty good size. So, and it has like a, a honey, like maple scent to it which is nice that's not us a usual scent that you'd find Ooh, next is a pixie item pixie by petra pixie is a, like a, a drugstore brand but it's very good quality items Ooh, this looks so nice so it's a cute little eyeshadow duo and they look like the way that they're pressed in the pan, it looks like they are raised. And mes it, this is the Mesmerizing Mineral Duo in Plum Lace. And that's definitely a good descriptor because the colors are more plummy toned. More neutral than warm. Beautiful, beautiful shades. So they both look to be... Um, shimmery but one is more glitterly gl glittery than the other so the white one very soft to the touch that's the white one and this is the darker one so they're both beautiful these are gonna be really nice I don't know that I would use them both as like um, eyeshadows on the lid but maybe the darker one as a crease color but this is so cute you could just throw it in your makeup bag and go this is so so adorable so the next item is a is an Aurora intensely precise eyeliner in espresso it's water-based alcohol free paraben free and perfume free which is always nice oh so it's um like a, a dark brown rich eyeliner that's awesome so I have like a brownish eyeliner but it's pencil I don't have a liquid eyeliner that is brown so this will definitely be a good one in my collection the next one the packaging is so cute like look at that look how adorable that is it's like a little spaceship in space it's a it's a powder blush by Space Case Cosmetics. Very cute packaging. So it's vegan and it has a bunch of um, things that it doesn't have like parabens and phthalates and things like that. Wow, this is so cute. Look at that color, gorgeous. Let me swatch it. It definitely feels powdery, but like not in a bad way. Um, it's like it's like at the bottom right here, but you can't really see it. It's very pale, 
So I don't know that it would look that good on my skin tone, but it definitely has some shimmer in it, like some champagne-y reflex. Um, you definitely do get a, a fair amount, it seems. The color is called Cosmic Gangster. Very cute. I don't know that uh, I would use this very often because it seems very pale, but it is very cute. The packaging is very cute. Next item is a Hey Honey Look Into My Eyes Retinol and Propolis Eye Mask. Really neat. So it comes in a tube like this, and you twist this if you have the strength to do so. Apparently I do not. So it's just a, a, an eye mask, I suppose. It's like a, a white cream. It smells slightly sweet. So it claims to provide intense hydration and brightening to tired, stressed under eye areas while smoothing wrinkles and reducing dark circles. That's really neat. And this is by the brand Hey Honey, I suppose. Um, let's see, the Ipsy card doesn't really uh, say much about these products, but this, um, I don't really have a problem with dry under eyes. It's really brightening that I have a problem with, so this is supposedly supposed to do that. So um, I will definitely try these out. So these are the items I got in this month's Ipsy box. Please, if you guys enjoy this video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you want to. Join the family. We have a lot of fun over here. We do a lot of reviews and such about for um, makeup, obviously. But um, on that note, honeypots, stay well and stay beautiful. Bye.